गेट ट्वेंटी एटीन सिविल इंजीनियरिंग सेट वन क्वेश्चन थर्टी टू अ क्लोज टैंक कंटेन्स पॉइंट फाइव मीटर थिक लेयर ऑफ मर्करी स्पेसिफिक ग्रेविटी थर्टीन पॉइंट सिक्स एट द बॉटम अ टू मीटर थिक लेयर ऑफ वॉटर लाइज अब द मर्करी लेयर अ थ्री मीटर थिक लेयर ऑफ ऑइल स्पेसिफिक ग्रेविटी पॉइंट सिक्स लाइज अब द वॉटर लेयर द स्पेस अब द ऑइल लेयर कंटेन्स एयर अंडर प्रेशर The gauge pressure at the bottom of the tank is 196.2 kN per meter square. The density of water is 1000 kg per meter cube and the acceleration due to gravity is 9.81 meter per second square. The value of pressure in the air space is four options are given. The relevant NPTEL reference has been mentioned. Coming to the useful data, if we are given a closed tank in which there are different liquids such as l1 l2 l3 and there is some air at the top which has its own pressure so the pressure at the base of the tank can be written as the pressure of the air plus the pressure of the individual liquid layers l1 l2 l3 and so on in this the pressure of the liquid layers will be the density of the particular liquid into acceleration due to gravity into the specific liquid's height which will be dl1 similarly for other liquids it will be pl2 the density for l2 liquid into g into depth of the l2 and so on for other liquid layers using this equation we can find either the pressure at the base or the pressure of the locked air in the tank in the given question the three liquid layers in the tank are mercury whose specific gravity is 13.6 and the depth is 0.5 meters from the bottom on top of the mercury layer is water of depth 2 meter and then there is oil of specific gravity 0.6 for depth 3 meters and on the very top is air which has a certain pressure of its own since it has been locked under pressure so the pressure at the base of the tank has been given in the question as 196.2 kN per meter square this will be equal to the sum of the air pressure and the sum of the oil layer pressure plus water plus the mercury layer so this whole pressure due to the liquids can be called as pl so pl would be equal to summation of i equals 1 to 3 the density of the ith layer into g into the depth of the ith layer this can be written as starting with the mercury layer so 13.6 into 1000 would be the density into g value 9.81 into the depth for mercury that is 0.5 similarly for water specific gravity 1 into 1000 into g is 9.81 and h would be 2 meters plus for oil we can write it as 0.6 into 1000 into 9.81 into 3 this value would turn out to be 1,3986 newton per meter square on converting this to kilonewtons would be 103.986 kilonewtons per meter square so p base is equal to the pressure of the air in the tank plus the total liquid pressure using this p air can be written as p base minus p liquid which will be p base has been given as 196.2 minus p liquid that was found as 103.986 this would turn out to be 92.214 kN per meter square which is the air pressure so 
the value of pressure in the air space was found out as 92.214 kN per meter square which is option A. The relevant NPTEL reference has been cited. Thank you.